Something tells me you got dressed listening to that Beyonce album. You know what? I haven't even listened to it yet. What, Joey? I know. What? I know. I know. Wow. I, I almost want to like not even do the interview and just play you some songs right now. Okay. So you. <laughs> like I literally, that's so fine with me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you killed this look tonight, though. I mean, you look fantastic. Are you feeling good? I feel great. I feel like this has been so much fun. This is the last stop of our press tour, right. for me anyway. Right. And I have had an amazing time playing with my wardrobe and my hair and my makeup, and this is just the cherry on top. Now, I have read that, taking it back to the beginning of this ride, since you're almost off of it, that you were at you were celebrating your 21st birthday when you found out you were oh the very beginning of this right. ride yes the 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 day I got the call that I was going to be in this movie it was my 21st birthday and I just turned 23 two days ago wow oh, yeah okay so how many shots in were you were was there a a, a a sushi train like what was the deal I was three old fashions deep ooh. I was pretty, I was pretty wavy. You were also classy, even at 21. I didn't get an old fashion until I was at least 32. <laughs> it's like, it's so good though. It's, like, so, it's good. so good. It's I so love, good. I, my, my favorite, one of my favorite forms of art is like, I think cocktails are a form of art. And I love finding places with amazing cocktails. I love making cocktails. Yeah. Cause I do think it's like a, the experience. a, a huge art form. It's a yeah. way of expression. So I love a good, I love a thought out cocktail. And I think a drink, a drink says a lot about a person. You learn a lot about a person by what the drink they order, you know? Yeah, I mean, you'd never know with me though because I'm all over the place. I love it all. I yeah, love same. it all. I mean, same. I'll take a shot, but I'll also go old fashioned with oh a Sazerac God. though. For, oh. See, speaking of absinthe, yeah. two days ago I did a shot of absinthe for the first time in my life. I've only ever, what? I've only ever done absinthe drip and like yeah. sipped it. Yeah, yeah. This was a shot. A shot of absinthe. Whoa. I had the worst headache. That I bet. Time. But it was a great 15 minutes. Honestly, it was like <laughs> I was just like, wow, what an experience. I mean, you know, it was my birthday. It of was course. an experience. You deserved it. Now I. I really moved in <laughs> That's when you know it's fashion. Wait, now, I, I, I read that you get you said you get giddy still when you pass the Hollywood sign. I do. Like, the, the, the romance of Hollywood is still not lost on you. But So then, tell me what happens when you when you take a selfie with these individuals yeah. at the Eiffel Tower. Is this, yeah. I mean. That was a moment. That was a life moment. Like, mm -hmm. first of all, I love these boys so much. They're like, they're such great friends now. And I'm so lucky to feel that way. But also, I'm so proud of our movie. I had so much fun with them on that tour. Like the night of the premiere, that of the Paris premiere that night, I was just like got a little emotional while we were on stage because it was just such a beautiful moment. Yeah, I mean, and it also is it's like I feel like a, another a, a windfall of opportunity on the other side of this movie for everybody in this picture. Like I feel like it's a game changing moment. <laughs> I, you do. Know what I, mean? I do. Yeah, I mean, it was it was such a special moment. Is anybody cooler than this dude? Brad? Oh my God, he's so cool. He's so cool. Right? I mean, he's the king of cool. The king? He steps on a red carpet and he's just like so cool. Okay, his mo his name in the movie is Ladybug. That's his like assassin alter ego. Yeah, what would sense. what would yours be? For myself? Yeah, you had to come up with it right now on the spot. Oh my God, uh, the, the, the capers and salmon lady. I don't know, it's my favorite thing to put on my bagel in the morning. It's like, you know, like the capers and the salmon and the, the whole schmear and the, you know, whatever. I don't know. <laughs> ah, 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 cap capers and schmear here no. oh, to, to kill you. To save the town. Town. <laughs> oh, so bad. No, it works. Okay, wait, I want to do this with you. A little bit of a fashion diary of sorts. Just some of our favorite looks of yours. Take me back to this one right here. Oh my God, leather in a heat wave in Paris was- <laughs> Why not? Really, this is a brand called Material. It was so, so awesome. Um, it just made me feel like so powerful. Yeah. And the it was just like, it was so hot that day and I was so sweaty, but I felt like a boss. And I think boss. I was like one thing. You, heck yeah, you do with the lock around the neck. I mean, come on. And then the finger waves with the with the long gloves the the circle pattern on the, come this was fun right yeah oh my god so this is Mark Jacobs and it was like uh, that 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 was the look I was both most excited and most nervous for because Why? it is such a risk yeah. um, but I knew I loved it so that's all that mattered but right. it was also like there was many risks involved not just about fashion but wardrobe malfunction risks what? Um, well just there was a completely open back and I'm not oh. entirely tiny chested so it was a lot of pressure on that tape, yeah. on the tape. 
Hoping in a prayer with that tape. A lot of tape. Hoping in a prayer. That could be. There's so much tape happening right now. Wait, too. maybe. <laughs> maybe that's the assassin name. The what? Tape. Okay. <laughs> sure. Maybe not. I love it. Wah, wah, wah. Well, mine was a wah, wah, too. <laughs> okay. And then finally, this one here. I mean. Balenciaga number. Come on. With pink hair. I was obsessed with this suit. I wore that for the Berlin premiere and it felt so Berlin to me. Um, I just The pink hair, the whole deal. Yeah, honestly, my favorite thing about all my looks on my press tour, including this one, is that like I've just stepped onto the carpet feeling so confident, which is really scary on a red carpet. You don't always feel that way. So I've been, I feel like I've stepped into my own on this tour. I feel like I should have called you before I got on the carpet because this is my first time wearing a skirt, and um, really? you never know. I don't have the right undergarments on. I think. Well, I have. I, yeah. Well, now I'm gonna get into mine. But <laughs> <laughs> you look. You look so like I'll at ease. You. At well, ease. you know, it's there's a there's a breeze that helps with Isn't that. Isn't it nice? Oh my God. Isn't it lovely? I think from now on you'll see me on the carpet in a. Just going like that. Yeah. No, you're. you're Wow. That's the best part. It's the best part. Thank you.